Ilocano, also Ilocano, Ilocano, Pagsaseo na Ilocano, is the third most spoken native language of the Philippines. An Austronesian language, it is related to such languages as Malay, Indonesian and Malaysian, Tetum, Chamorro, Fijian, Maori, Hawaiian, Samoan, Tahitian, Paiwan and Malagasy. It is closely related to some of the other Austronesian languages of northern Luzon, and has slight mutual intelligibility with the Balangao language and the eastern dialects of the Bontoc language. The Ilocano people had their own distinct indigenous writing system and script, known as Kuraitan. There have been proposals to revive the Kuraitan script by teaching it in Ilocano majority public and private schools in Ilocos Norte and Ilocos Sur. Classification Ilocano, like all Philippine languages, is an Austronesian language, a very expansive language family believed to originate in Taiwan. Ilocano comprises its own branch within the Philippine Cordilleran language subfamily. It is spoken as first language by 7 million people, a lingua franca of the northern region of the Philippines. It is spoken as a secondary language by more than 2 million people who are native speakers of Ivanig, Ivatan, and other languages in northern Luzon. Geographic distribution The language is spoken in northwest Luzon, the Babuyan Islands, Cordillera Administrative Region, Cagayan Valley, parts of central Luzon, Mindoro and scattered areas in Mindanao. The language is also spoken in the United States, with Hawaii and California having the largest number of speakers. It is the third most spoken non-English language in Hawaii after Tagalog and Japanese, with 17% of those speaking languages other than English at home, 25.4% of the population, speaking the language. In September 2012, the province of La Union passed an ordinance recognizing Ilocano, Iloco, as an official provincial language, alongside Filipino and English, as national and official languages of the Philippines, respectively. It is the first province in the Philippines to pass an ordinance protecting and revitalizing a native language, although there are also other languages spoken in the province of La Union, including Pangasinan and Kankanayi. Writing system Modern alphabet the modern Ilocano alphabet of 28 letters A B flat C C D D E F F G G H H E J J K K L L M N N U N N G N G U P P Q Q R R S S T T U U V V W W X X Y Y Z Z. Pre-colonial. Pre-colonial Ilocano people of all classes wrote in a syllabic system known as Baybayan prior to European arrival. They used a system that is termed as an abugida, or an alphasyllabary. It was similar to the Tagalog and Pangasinan scripts, where each character represented a consonant vowel, or CV, sequence. The Ilocano version, however, was the first to designate coda consonants with a diacritic mark, a cross or varama, shown in the Doctrina Cristiana of 1621, one of the earliest surviving Ilocano publications. Before the addition of the Varama, writers had no way to designate coda consonants. The reader, on the other hand, had to guess whether the vowel was read or not, due to this vowels. E and I are interchangeable and letters. O and U, for instance, Tendera and Tindira, shop assistant. Modern. In recent times, there have been two systems in use, the Spanish system and the Tagalog system. In the Spanish system words of Spanish origin kept their spellings. Native words, on the other hand, conformed to the Spanish rules of spelling. Most older generation of Ilocanos use the Spanish system. In the system based on that of Tagalog there is more of a phoneme to letter correspondence, and better reflects the actual pronunciation of the word. The letters in constituted digraph and counts as a single letter, following N in alphabetization. As a result, numo humility appears before nondal to chew in newer dictionaries. Words of foreign origin, most notably those from Spanish, need to be changed in spelling to better reflect Ilocano phonology. Words of English origin may or may not conform to this orthography. A prime example using this system is the weekly magazine Banawag. Samples of the two systems 
The following are two versions of the Lord's Prayer. The one on the left is written using the Spanish-based orthography, while the one on the right uses the Tagalog-based system. Ilocano and education With the implementation by the Spanish of the bilingual education system of 1897, Ilocano, together with the other seven major languages, those that have at least a million speakers, was allowed to be used as a medium of instruction until the second grade. It is recognized by the Commission on the Filipino Language as one of the major languages of the Philippines. Constitutionally, Ilocano is an auxiliary official language in the regions where it is spoken and serves as auxiliary media of instruction therein. In 2009, the Philippine Department of Education instituted Department Order 74, S. 2009 stipulating that mother tongue-based multilingual education would be implemented. In 2012, Department Order 16, S. 2012 stipulated that the mother tongue-based multilingual system was to be implemented for kindergarten to grade 3 effective school year 2012-2013. Ilocano is used in public schools mostly in the Ilocos region and the Cordilleras. It is the primary medium of instruction from kindergarten to grade 3 except for the Filipino and English subjects and is also a separate subject from grade 1 to grade 3. Thereafter, English and Filipino are introduced as mediums of instructions. Literature Ilocano animistic past offers a rich background in folklore, mythology and superstition see religion in the Philippines. There are many stories of good and malevolent spirits and beings. Its creation mythology centers on the giants Aaron and her husband Angelo, and Namarsua, the creator. The epic story Biag ni Lam Ang, The Life of Lam Ang, is undoubtedly one of the few indigenous stories from the Philippines that survived colonialism, although much of it is now acculturated and shows many foreign elements in the retelling. It reflects values important to traditional Ilocano society. It is a hero's journey steeped in courage, loyalty, pragmatism, honor, and ancestral and familial bonds. Ilocano culture revolves around life rituals, festivities and oral history. These were celebrated in songs Kankantha, dances Salsala, poems Dandani, riddles Berbersha, proverbs Pagsaseo, literary verbal jousts called Bukanagan, named after the writer Pedro Bukanag, and is the equivalent of the Balagdazan of the Tagalogs, and epic stories. Phonology Segmental Vowels. Modern Ilocano has two dialects, which are differentiated only by the way the letter E is pronounced. In the Amian and Northern dialect, there exist only five vowels, while the Abagatan Southern dialect employs six. Amian and A I U O Abagatan A I U O. Reduplicate vowels are not slurred together, but voiced separately with an intervening glottal stop. San, sa, an, no, s i i t, c, it, thorny letter in bold is the graphic, written, representation of the vowel. For a better rendition of vowel distribution, please refer to the IPA vowel chart. Unstressed, a, is pronounced, t, in all positions except final syllables, like madi, md, cannot be, but nagiwit, mouth, is pronounced, iwa. Although the modern Tagalog writing system is largely phonetic, there are some notable conventions. O, U and I, E In native morphemes, the close back rounded vowel, U, is written differently depending on the syllable. If the vowel occurs in the ultima of the morpheme, it is written O, elsewhere, U. Example Root, Ludo Cook Agluto to cook, Luchuan to cook something, example, Luchuan data. Instances such as masapulmento, you will manage to find it, to need it, are still consistent. Note that masapulmento is, in fact, three morphemes, masapul, verb base, mo, pronoun, and n, to, future particle. An exception to this rule, however, is lot, la, ud, west. Also, U and final stressed syllables can be pronounced O, like D, Nam for Danum, water. 
The two vowels are not highly differentiated in native words due to the fact that o was an allophone of u in the history of the language. In words of foreign origin, notably Spanish, they are phonemic. Example USO use Oso bear Unlike U and O, I and E are not allophones, but I in final stressed syllables in words ending in consonants can be like U being B, child. The two closed vowels become glides when followed by another vowel. The close back rounded vowel, U, becomes W before another vowel, and the close front unrounded vowel, I, J. Example Kuarta slash quadata, money. Paria slash pa dot ja, bitter melon. In addition, dental, alveolar consonants become palatalized before i, see consonants below. Unstressed, i, and, u, are pronounced, and, except in final syllables, like pintas, beauty, pn, tas, and button, fear, b, but banger, other side, and parabor, grace, are pronounced, ba, i, and, p, a, boo. Pronunciation of e. The letter E represents two vowels in the non-nuclear dialects areas outside the Ilocos provinces, in words of foreign origin and in native words, and only one in the nuclear dialects of the Ilocos provinces. Diphthongs Diphthongs are combination of a vowel and I or U. In the orthography, the secondary vowels underlying I or U are written with their corresponding glide, Y or W, respectively. Of all the possible combinations, only AJ or EJ, IW, AJ, and UJ occur. In the orthography, vowels in sequence such as UO and I do not coalesce into a diphthong, rather, they are pronounced with an intervening glottal stop, for example, book hair, B, uk, and a so, da, it. The diphthong, A, is a variant of I in native words. Other occurrences are in words of Spanish and English origin. Examples are reina i, na from Spanish reina, queen, and trainer te, n, trainer. The diphthongs oi and ui may be interchanged since o is an allophone of u in final syllables. Thus, a pui fire may be pronounced pui and baboy pig may be pronounced slash ba dot bui. Consonants all consonantal phonemes except h may be a syllable onset or coda. The phoneme H is a borrowed sound and rarely occurs in coda position. Although the Spanish word reloy clock would have been heard as re dot low, the final H is dropped, resulting in slash re dot low. However, this word also may have entered the Ilocano lexicon at early enough a time that the word was still pronounced slash re dot low, with the J pronounced as in French, resulting in slash re dot loss in Ilocano. As a result, both slash re dot low and slash re dot loss occur. The glottal stop is not permissible as coda, it can only occur as onset. Even as an onset, the glottal stop disappears in affixation. Take for example the root aromat, raw dot mat, use. When prefixed with ag, the expected form is asterisk, raw dot mat. But the actual form is raw dot mat, the glottal stop disappears. In a reduplicated form, the glottal stop returns and participates in the template CVC, agar aromat, r, ra dot mat. Stops are pronounced without aspiration. When they occur as coda, they are not released, for example, sungbat, s dot bat, answer, response. Ilocano is one of the Philippine languages which is excluded from d, allophony, as r, in many cases is derived from a proto ostwanzian asterisk r, compare bago, Tagalog, and baro, Ilocano, nu. The language marginally has a trill r, which was spelled as rr, for example, serik, re, to enter. Trill, r, is sometimes an allophone of t, in word initial position and word final positions, spelled as single. But it is different in proper names of foreign origin, mostly Spanish, like Serrano, which is correctly pronounced Rano. Some speakers, however, pronounce Serrano as Ano. Prosody primary stress The placement of primary stress is lexical in Ilocano. This results in minimal pairs such as slash ka dot yo, wood, and ka, yo, you, plural or polite, or slash ki dot ta, class, type, kind, and ki, ta, si. In written Ilocano the reader must rely on context, thus ko and kita. 
primary stress can fall only on either the penult or the ultima of the root, as seen in the previous examples. While stress is unpredictable in a locano, there are notable patterns that can determine where stress will fall depending on the structures of the penult, the ultima and the origin of the word. Foreign words, the stress of foreign, mostly Spanish, words adopted into a locano fall on the same syllable as the original, cvc, cv, c, hash, but cv, kv, c, hash in words with a closed penult, stress falls on the ultima, except for instances of t, k, where it is the penult, c, j, w, b hash in words whose ultima is a glide plus a vowel, stress falls on the ultima, c, cv, b c hash in words where v v and b is the same vowel for the penult and ultima, the stress falls falls on the penult. Secondary stress Secondary stress occurs in the following environments, syllables whose coda is the onset of the next, i.e., the syllable before a geminate, reduplicated consonant vowel sequence resulting from morphology or lexicon vowel length vowel length coincides with stressed syllables primary or secondary, and only on open syllables except for ultimas, for example, slash single quote ka colon dot yo, tree versus ka, yo, second person plural ergative pronoun. Stress shift as primary stress can fall only on the penult or the ultima, suffixation causes a shift in stress one syllable to the right. The vowel of open penults that result lengthen as a consequence. Grammar A locano is typified by a predicate initial structure. Verbs and adjectives occur in the first position of the sentence, then the rest of the sentence follows. Ilocano uses a highly complex list of affixes, prefixes, suffixes, infixes and enclitics and reduplications to indicate a wide array of grammatical categories. Learning simple root words and corresponding affixes goes a long way in forming cohesive sentences. Lexicon Borrowings Foreign accretion comes largely from Spanish, followed by English and smatterings of much older accretion from Hokkien, Min Nan, Arabic and Sanskrit. Common expressions Alokano shows a TV distinction. Numbers, days, months Numbers Ilocano uses two number systems, one native and the other derived from Spanish. Ilocano uses a mixture of native and Spanish numbers. Traditionally Ilocano numbers are used for quantities and Spanish numbers for time or days and references. Examples Spanish Monotitawinmo? How old are you, in years, lit. How many years do you have? Baintayuno. 21. Luctanio dagiti bibliayo iti libro ni Juan capitulo tres versicolo decisis. Open your Bibles to the book of John chapter 3 verse 16, Ilocano. Mano a kilo t bagas t kayatmo? How many kilos of rice do you want? Sangapulo lang. Ten only, ada dua na akana. He has two fish, lit. There are two fish with him. Days of the week. Days of the week are directly borrowed from Spanish. Months. Like the days of the week, the names of the months are taken from Spanish. Units of time. The names of the units of time are either native or are derived from Spanish. The first entries in the following table are native, the second entries are Spanish-derived. To mention time, Ilocanos use a mixture of Spanish and Ilocano. 1 a.m. a la una iti bigot, 1 in the morning. 2.30 p.m. a las dos y media iti malam, in Spanish, a las dos y media de la tarde or Half past two in the afternoon. More Ilocano words. See also Ilocano grammar, Ilocano numbers, Ilocano particles, Ilocano verb. 
Notes References External links Tarabe iti Orthographia t Paxiseo na Ilocano, a free ebook version of the guide on the orthography of the Ilocano language developed by the Comasayan ng Wiking Filipino KWF, in consultation with various stakeholders in Ilocano language and culture. Developed back in 2012 as a resource material for the implementation of the Department of Education's K-12 curriculum with the integration of MTBMLE or Mother Tongue-based Multilingual Education. The Online Ilocano Dictionary Project TOIDP, a free Ilocano dictionary application for people to utilize so that they may overcome the language barriers existing between the English and Ilocano languages. Mobile application, TOIDP, Ilocano Search Free, a free Apple iOS mobile application that allows users to search our database of entries. Bansa.org Ilocano Dictionary Materials in Ilocano from Paradisec Ilocano.org A project for building an online Ilocano dictionary. Also features Ilocano songs, and a community forum. Ilocano Swadesh Vocabulary List Ilocano, T. Paxiseo T. Amianan, webpage by linguist Dr. Carl R. Galvez Rubino, author of Dictionaries on Iloco and Tagalog. Iloco.com Popular Ilocano web portal featuring Ilocano songs, Iloco fiction and poetry, Ilocano riddles, and a lively Ilocano forum, Dap Ion. Manarat.com blog of an Ilocano fictionist and poet written in Iloco and featuring original and Iloco fiction and poetry, literary analysis and criticism focused on Ilocano literature, and literary news about Iloco writing and writers and organization like the GUMIL, Gunglo Dagiti Manarat na Ilocano. Samtoy.blogspot.com Iloco blog maintained by Ilocano writers Raimundo Pascua Adan and Joel Manuel. Austronesian Basic Vocabulary Database Datapilan.com, an Iloco literature portal featuring Iloco works by Ilocano writers and forum for Iloco literary study, criticism and online workshop. Vocabularios de la Lengua Ilocana by NPS. Agustin, published in 1849. Tugo A blog maintained by Ilocano writer Jake Ilac.